To kick off his performance at the Super Bowl, Kendrick Lamar surprised almost everyone with his song, Mad City. Although he didn't sing the entire track or really all that much of it, many were surprised to hear him start things off with it. We're going to talk all about Kendrick's performance right now on I.O. What's happening guys? Welcome back to the channel. I'm your host for this one, Jared Pepper Bronstein, the spiciest host in the mother freaking game. And before we do get into it, you got to do me a solid. You got to just take that little button there. You got to smash that like button, baby. You got to smash it, baby. All right. So Compton's very own Kendrick Lamar took to the stage which was set out to resemble Los Angeles while performing one of his biggest hits, Mad City. However, it was the song All Right which has been played at numerous Black Lives Matter protests which really appeared to highlight his performance. Lamar, who was surrounded by dancers wearing satchels reading Dre Day, may have also been censored, yet no one could know for sure. More specifically in his song All Right, there's a specific line in which Lamar raps, and we hate Popo, wanna kill us dead in the street for show. I don't feel I need to clarify this, but in case any of you missed the reference, when Lamar says Popo, he's referring to the police. During the performance itself, when those specific lyrics were expected, the broadcast showed a bird's eye view of Lamar in the stadium, so it is possible they deliberately omitted the lyrics. Leading up to the big game, there was plenty of talk of censorship, with numerous sources claiming all the performers were warned to not do anything politically motivated. It seems they ignored those wishes, as Dre still rapped about not loving the police, and Eminem appeared to take a knee in support for Colin Kaepernick. Snoop Dogg dropped a song called Police just a few weeks back, in which he raps about gangsters shooting the cops instead of each other, and to no surprise that led to some law enforcement claiming they'd be boycotting the Super Bowl altogether. The NFL denied any claims they tried to censor the artists, with a representative explaining, I quote, we watched every rehearsal this week and these elements were included. As you know, no player, coach, or personnel member has been sanctioned for taking a knee, so there would be no reason for us to tell a performer he or she could not for whatever reason. However, as we know, when things like this go down, it usually takes some time for the truth to come out. Was Kendrick censored? or did he purposely omit the line? Let me know what you guys think down below and we'll catch you in the next one.